Okay, it's uh, Tuesday, and uh, we, uh, towards the end of August, I don't know what, what the date is, 22nd, something like that. Anyways, uh, there's work being done on the outside of the house, so uh, we'll give you updates as to what's going on. There's also work going on inside the house, where cuts are being made uh, to the... Um, boxes that will go inside the windows. Uh, I'll show you one of those in, in just a minute. Um, so uh, it's good to see that there's work going on. Um, give you a sense of the work that's being done on the outside of the house. So there's silver board that's being uh, adhered to this styrofoam so they're putting styrofoam in first then they put silver board and then I think they're putting another layer of uh, styrofoam on the outside of that um, and then they'll uh, tack it all together to uh, tie it into the ICF that's uh, on top Let's see if I can give you a little bit tighter view I'll just be coming back and forth to this. Uh, my hope is, and we haven't had confirmation of this yet, that they're going to be able to actually do the installation of not only that gable end, but also the gable end that you can see for the south main part of the building, and uh, finish off the insulation so that by Thursday, um, and that means uh, installation of the windows, uh, etc., uh, so by Thursday, apparently, the um, the J, uh, J channels, etc., um, for the siding are going to be arriving on site and installed so that we can get the siding up. This is all in an effort to um, have the exterior complete uh, with siding by... Uh, the middle of next week when uh, we'll have another inspection by the uh, company that's doing our um, assessment and uh, they make a report to the mortgage company whether we're ready for a mortgage or not. So we hope to be by next week Wednesday, so a week from tomorrow, 97% uh, complete in terms of the major structural things. That's that's the plan. Or at least that's the plan from our perspective. I'm not sure if that's the plan from our contractor's perspective, but maybe I hope that it is. Hopefully that we're in line with each other. Right, it's Tuesday, uh, August what? Twenty third. Twenty third, and uh, we've had a good day of work. Um, so what we'll do is we'll walk around at the house. Oh, they did actually. I didn't see that they had done that one, um, and uh, show you the kinds of work that's been done and uh, give you um, some ideas as to what's going to be happening next. So the major work that was done inside is that the boxes around most of the windows, at least the majority of them, will we'll tell you which ones uh, have not been done yet, but um, have been given this kind of treatment. So if you take a look at uh, what's happened here, is that we've got some MDF boxes that have been created around the window frame itself. And then in this particular case, uh, not all of these have been done yet, but um, the space in between where the ICF walls and the window boxes now are, it's totally filled in with uh, foam. And it's all the way around. And so what will happen is that we will be finishing these off with capping. Um, so it'll be the, the white um, trim that's very similar to the baseboards that you see down there uh, going all the way around. And that'll finish off the window itself. And then later we'll have to 
um, uh, obviously uh, paint all, all of it. So this window has been done as well. The window in behind well, Trisha's <laughs> yeah. Trisha's um, chair. her chair. The large window in the kitchen has been done as well. So you can see the window box is in, but again in this particular instance there is no uh, foam yet. Uh, that'll happen probably tomorrow. Um, the windows in behind the counter have not been done because those have to wait until the counters actually show up on the 29th and uh, so those haven't been done. The one up there has also not been done yet. Um, those four windows up there will be trimmed out uh, before the end of this week. That window will be trimmed out um, before the end of this week. We're hoping that the doors and the rest of the windows will actually be showing up on Thursday and that by Friday we're hoping there may be actually um, uh, siding on the outside of the house. You can see in Rachel's room, the window box has been installed there as well. But there is, they, they did have the window or the sliding door open at one point in our um, in the master bedroom you can see that there's lots of styrofoam little pieces on the ground uh, they had it open because they actually finished off the uh, exterior the, um, this, the insulation on the outside of the gable that's there uh, I'll show you that uh, in a little bit shall we go downstairs Rach? Trisha was able to finish off the staining, as you'll see in the previous video, once I get it edited. The uh, window box here for the bathroom window, or sorry, the laundry room window has been done. Um, it's been foamed as well, so you can see that there's been foam inserted around the window box itself. Um, that door has not been done yet, but again, that's one of those things, hopefully on Thursday, will be done. In my office, the window has been done, and I've got the, the flowers back up again, but there's no foam around the outside yet. So that will be done shortly, tomorrow maybe. And then in Mum's studio, the two windows in here have been done. So this one just got the window box and the big window has a window box as well. Makes it look much nicer. Oh, and uh, Trisha and I were able to reorganize things a little bit. So you can see that there's actually pathways that you actually get to the windows now. And if you take a look inside the storage room, we've uh, filled up the storage rack with uh, more of our materials. And now there's actually some room. We've got a plan moving forward. Um, so many of these paintings that you're seeing here will actually end up on the walls in places in the house itself. I uh, can't remember where this window is going, but this painting here is uh, what dreams may come, and that'll be in our bedroom, beside, uh, on the wall beside uh, our place. Um, what's this one called? Dreams. No, no sorry, not dreams. Butterfly uh, butterflies, effect. right. Butterfly effect. So we'll go beside the TV in the great room. 
And where the rest of these go, I don't know. But I want uh, to go above the, like, on the when you go up the stairs, that wall. Mm-hmm. Because I, I think this yeah, one's too big. Yeah, Grossmore Park. Uh, well, yeah, I don't, it, it's too big for above our bedroom. This can go in Our room. bed. Don't know exactly. But Mom's got a plan, so. Or Patricia has a plan. So we'll have to see. Um, there's still a fair amount of our clothing around. So, for instance, uh, that's linens. Um, but there's uh, winter clothes in our backpacks that we usually take when we're traveling. Um, oh, and there, the, the two suitcases here have winter clothes in them as well. So there's still things that are not quite set yet. <laughs> oh, and Rach, well, one of the things that you'll have to do very quickly is you'll need to move these things out of, way, out of the way so that they can put the door handle on. Okay. It, it, it's just that Chris doesn't want to do that kind of stuff, or uh, Joe doesn't want to do that stuff. So we need to, to move it out of the way so he can get the handle on. Mm-hmm. Same thing has to happen in the storage room. I didn't realize, when did all the stuff from the... Today. Oh, today, okay. We just, just moved the stuff out of the way. So now, uh, LB has a lot more room to lay down. <laughs> he needs more laying. Don't you, don't you, yes. Um, this door window has not been done because we weren't sure that it wasn't going to rain. And as a consequence, they didn't want to have rain damaging the window box. Um, so they just didn't, it's cut and it's made. They just didn't put it in place. Well, why would... Because this is the window that was getting most of the leaking. Oh. And it's, it's the water that's coming out, out from the outside. And it's because there's no flashing on top of the window. So the, the water just runs down the wall and it starts running inside across the top of the window uh, itself. All right, so outside, you won't be able to see as much, but, um, and, and so this wall has not been completed yet. Uh, that wall hasn't changed, but if we go around the back, oh, we did get, we did get all of the, the trailer was emptied once. So the additional styrofoam is now in the trailer. It fits. Oh, I have to take clothes off yet. But the entire gable end now, up there, is complete around the sliding door. So I can put your door in. Yeah, the, that, that'll come on Thursday. And then um, what they're also going to do is finish off the gable end uh, above the great room door that's going to happen uh, on uh, tomorrow and then they'll probably not finish all of the insulation uh, around the top in between the two two walls until next week or something but it'll be close and the siding will go on um, Thursday or Friday supposed to be delivered Thursday or Friday. Cool. It should go pretty quick once the, all, all of the strapping's on. It's ready to go. So. We'll be seeing some major movement. And this is what, what we did on Friday so that we've got the opportunity to actually make use of the dryer. So this is just temporary. You can see the mess that the water the storm that we had on Saturday, um, or in Sunday, I can't remember when we have all that rain coming down, Saturday, because um, Sunday we were at the concert. Anyways, it's a big hole, and we'll have to fill all of that in with foam and uh, all kinds of stuff, but the dryer works in the meantime. Oh, this has to be done yet. Dry well. Has to be buried, and oh, this is interesting. 
So this is the dry well as as we have it right now. What's a dry well? So it's essentially a French French drain. Okay. Um, you just have a, a big area in, in that's buried, and uh, you've got these pipes going into it. That's where that that actual hole is being used by the uh, water conditioner at this point in time. Is where our external tap will be coming through oh, okay. the wall. But for the time being, those two pipes are coming out. It's not the way things are supposed to be done, but I guess it's temporary. Big air conditioning unit. And I think that's the piping that they're going to use for the, dra the, the dry well. And then we'll need to start thinking about finishing off the landscaping moving topsoil around and doing that kind of stuff. So the plan is that uh, they're going to finish off the, um, the thermal wall tomorrow um, on the, uh, the west wall. They're going to be installing the rest of the windows and the two sliding doors on Thursday. And Friday they'll be putting siding on, uh, finishing off the fascia the uh, sorry, finishing off the soffits, doing the the uh, the fascia, so all of the exposed wood will disappear, and then all of the siding itself will uh, be played, put in place. So where you're seeing the horizontal pieces of uh, backing, that will all be vertical black siding. Here where you're seeing the vertical uh, pieces, that will be horizontal uh, wood colored stained um, siding. So the corners are going to be wrapped in this wood material. Wow. It's still metal, but it looks like it's got a wood grain on it. And then the in between the windows is going to be vertical black. And then again, we're going to be wrapping the corner and the entire wall here on uh, the west facing wall will all be the horizontal wood grain finish metal. And that should all happen by the end of the week, in theory. Joe will continue working on the inside and then next week they'll finish off the garage. Uh, maybe this week they'll finish off. Uh, it depends. What about uh, the garage doors? So the garage doors will probably be uh, next week at some point. So they exist as well? Apparently. Okay. But uh, they probably won't get to finishing off the garage on the inside until next week. Because mm -hmm. that'll be after it, it's technically not, it's not part, part of the so the requirements not, for the yeah. house. And then the porch. Um, the, yeah. So. Or entrance way, I guess. We'll have to pursue that one as as well. Um, uh, again, it, it's not required. Exactly. We are we're holding uh, Jay accountable for it, so it'll be a question of. Uh, you know, getting it uh, made and installed. So Mom and I have talked a little bit about what is going to go on the ground there, and we're, we're thinking um, paving stones of some kind at this point. What do you mean on the ground? So at the front entrance, right outside the front door, instead of having a metal, or sorry, uh, a pad that is uh, yeah, poured, Anyways, so there's been uh, quite a bit of progress today, and uh, thank goodness. Um, so I'll get this uh, edited and off to you as soon as possible. Um, so we'll talk to you soon.